Hey guys, so this Ray and I'm here with a quick word real quick, just like a reminder. Um, be just be careful of who you are sharing your promises with, your blessings with. And I'm not talking about physically. Yes, that is important too to to use discernment with sharing um your blessings with specific people, but I'm more so talking about like speaking about these things with people friends, family, whoever, not that everyone is going to have bad intentions or not that everyone's going to try to like um, find stuff out and then be manipulative or conniving, things like that. But just in general, like when you're speaking about things pertaining to the kingdom and your promises and things like that, not everybody's going to understand it. Not everybody even knows what what it is like. They're not even going to understand it. They're not going to be able to really comprehend it. So their perspective isn't going to be the same as the things that you know or the things that you understand about Basically, you. Basically, they could be coming with, with still an earthly perspective, an earthly view. Um, and that's not exactly correct. the correct advice that you that you should be allowing or allowing to alter your perception or basically certain things that people say whether they intend to or not could cause confusion could cause doubt fear and in the things that you know that the lord has promised you or told you is going to happen for you just because they don't understand kingdom assignments kingdom promises blessings like kingdom marriage for example they they may not understand it so for for them it's going to be like they're going to look at you sideways but and then they may say something that that'll kind of like throw you off or like that's going to be opposite or different than what you what you know what you've been believing but they're coming with their logic and then so you know what i mean you don't get what i'm trying to say so just be careful with to speak into your life um especially pertaining to things that you know god has told you to do whether it's a marriage whether it's um starting a business whether it's you picking up and moving um whether it's you leaving a job starting a new job whatever the case may be like if you know god has told you something if you know god has promised you something if you know god is guiding you to, to do something don't allow other people just be careful of who you're talking to because don't even allow them to even put that other perspective the earthly perspective of their opinions or their thoughts or them not understanding something and and that could that could lead way for you to begin doubting the stuff that you already know god told you so just be careful um this happened to me like last week i think or maybe the week before that but so i just want to put that out there for y'all just as, as a reminder to be careful of who you're sharing your promises with and just just understand that everybody's not going to understand hopefully so, this word comes in handy <laughs> somebody hopefully this word was confirmation to someone or a blessing to somebody any type of way but um i'll be posting i have something i have a video i'm releasing tomorrow it's already I already uploaded it but it's just scheduled for tomorrow at 12 in the afternoon so y'all check that out stay tuned if y'all if it's i don't know if it's going to be on y'all notifications but if it is go ahead and add it to y'all watch later or whatever yes and i'll be back with another word for y'all